outside. I'm just trying to be friendly, you know. Well, I have enough friends. I don't need another one. Especially just got off a banana boat. Mysterious Avenger <laughs> and sworn enemy of the Ice Tyrant. <laughs> Trust you, Julian. I just want my 50k, all right? With a touch of brown sugar, teaming up with Mr. T. It's cool. Teaming up with Mr. T. Only boys that save their pennies make my rainy day game. When we're dancing, the night begins to shine. What's up, funkheads? This is Collecting Plastic coming to you with a very righteous news brief. The new wave of Teen Titans Go Pops were announced, and they are some of the most radical pops I have ever seen. They're based on how the Teen Titans look in the episodes that feature the song The Night Begins to Shine by B.E.R. Out of all the Teen Titans Go episodes, they are my absolute favorite, especially the four episode special called The Day the Night Stopped Beginning to Shine and Became Dark Even Though It Was Day. They're just really awesome. The song is so rad that it opens up a portal into this like 80s fantasy world. It's really great. It's really epic. You guys have to check it out if you haven't seen it. We're going to get all of the Teen Titans and also CeeLo Bear. And yeah, that's CeeLo as in CeeLo Green. The line between playing to win and sin is thin. Uh, but I walk it with grace and I talk it with taste. I am that raw, simply put, and I rest my case. It's elementary, yet far more than resources to pay the rent for me. Every but I'm not sure if the box is going to say CeeLo Bear on there or just Bear. Might be some kind of licensing issue there. There will also be a Toys R Us flocked exclusive version. But yeah, the Bear is CeeLo's alter ego in this 80s world. The night begins to shine. Unfortunately, there's no chases in this wave. With Funko making so many chases lately, I would have thought that this would have been the perfect opportunity to make some really great ones. Like they could have had CeeLo as a chase for the bear, Cyborg wearing the wolf, some of the other Teen Titans with their helmets. It would have been pretty cool. There's also going to be a glow in the dark Toys R Us exclusive of Cyborg with him holding the battle axe, which is pretty cool. Honestly, I think all of these should have been glow in the dark. It would have been really appropriate to how they're represented in the show, but at least we get one. I hope these sell really well because I would like to have pops of the actual band B.E.R. I think they would look incredible. Also Fallout Bot. Yeah, Fallout Boy is also in these episodes. And a pop ride of Cyborg riding that metallic Pegasus. Overall, I'm really happy with the way this wave turned out. All the Teen Titans Go Pops in the past have been painted really well and sculpted really well. So I'm pretty confident these are going to turn out really nice in person. You can really see the story in their eyes and they're a must have for me. These are slated to hit stores in February of 2018. I'd rather die of exhaustion than die of starvation. Can you uh, pick that one apart? Well, what, what does that mean? Do you heal me? Do you care? Megatron must be stopped, no matter the cost. That ain't Lake Minnetonka. 